just want you to stop using it. And instead, I want to give you more vocabulary. As an IC nurse, I have one of these words that I strongly dislike as well. And also, I love Jen. I'm not sure if she'll see this, but I love you. I love your content. You're one of my favorite nurses to follow. And if you're not following her, you need to go check her out. I despise the word stable. Stable to you, stable to me, stable to your neighbor, all mean different things. And I feel like when people hear the word stable, they just, they hold on to that word so tight and they're like, that means the patient's doing okay. They're stable. When in reality, stable to you and I can mean different things. Someone can be on 100% oxygen on a ventilator on four pressers and their vital signs appear stable. But in reality, that patient has a lot going on and they're requiring a lot of support. So I try to take that word stable out of my vocabulary and instead I like to use the word support. How much support is this patient requiring? This patient's on a ventilator that is supporting their breathing. They're on 100% oxygen, which is the max amount of oxygen we can give someone to help support them. This patient's requiring four pressors, meaning four different medications that are supporting this patient's blood pressure. Without these medications, the patient would not have a blood pressure that would be sustainable with life. The patient got 10 blood products last night to help support them. I feel like it's easier for patients and family members to kind of quantify things when you're going off the amount of things that are being required to, in order to support the patient. I also like to use the word improving instead of stable. Is this patient improving? Are they making forward progress or are they going backward? For example, today the patient was able to get off the ventilator. They are improving in the fact that they are now breathing on their own without the support of the ventilator. I hope this gives you some tools of different words and phrases to say to people. And I throw the word stable out there occasionally. I really try not to, but it happens every once in a while. And I always like in my head, I'm like, no, nope, don't use that word because it just means too many things to different people. But I hope that's helpful. Let me know if you have any questions.